I will give you a, a broader definition and then more of a, a practical definition. So in a broader sense, every thought about the past or the future is a private thought. And so, when we go into meditation, we are wanting to release all of these thoughts. To come into the presence of the present moment. And in a more practical definition, a private thought is like a secret that you are keeping. Because you are afraid of what it would mean if this thought was shared. 因为你害怕，假设我跟别人分享这个秘密的话，会发生什么后果？So private thoughts are like uh, playing a game of, of deception and of secrets with your mind. 所以的话，事实上这个私人念头是让你在跟你的心灵在玩一个欺骗的游戏。Because there is a fear of some outcome in the world. 因为你会害怕。我的这个私人念头会带来，会导致这个一个后果，在这个世界上会有一个后果。A private thought could be a fearful thought or an embarrassing thought. 然后一个私人念头可以是一个恐惧的念头，也可以是一个非常尴尬的念头。A humiliating thought. 或是你觉得非常耻辱的一个念头。And the reason that they are kept hidden is because they are believed to be true. 你之所以想要隐藏这些念头，是因为你相信他们是真的。Even though they are all ego thoughts. 那尽管事实上他们全部都是小我的念头。And none of them are true. 他们当中没有一个是真的。And we have had experiences in the past when we have shared a private thought. 然后我们过去有一些不好的经验，就当时我们曾经跟别人分享我们的私人念头。and there has been a, a very uh, sharp consequence for sharing that thought. Yeah, and we may say, I will never do that again. I don't want to face that consequence ever again. And and so we get into the habit of making secret thoughts. 所以我们就养成了习惯，就是就隐藏了很多的这个秘密的念头。And while we keep them secret, our mind remains very closed. 所以当我们呃当我们隐藏这些念头的时候，就我们的心灵就变得非常的封闭。And when we allow them into awareness and expose them. Then they lose their power. When we share a private thought or a private emotion with a dear friend, there is a feeling of release. And there is nothing special with sharing these thoughts with a person. Except that it is symbolic that we would share these thoughts with the Holy Spirit. And that is how these thoughts disappear. When we protect them away from the Holy Spirit, we keep them. 
。当我们想要不想让这个圣灵知道自己的生命后，跟圣灵保密的时候 ，we keep them, keep them in buried in our mind。呀，就这样的话，就我们的圣灵就就一直埋藏在我们的心灵当中。And when we do not protect them and offer them to the Holy Spirit, they disappear. 当我们不再保护这些圣灵念头，然后把他们交到圣灵的手中的时候，他们就消失了。And it works the same with every private thought. 所以这个每一个念头，你都可以，每一个圣念头，你都可以用同样的方式去处理